Ducky, and today I'm super excited because I have Poppy O'Hare, Dragon Games doll, and she comes with a dragon, so I thought that was really cool. Here's a look at the front of her box. Thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching this video, and just in case you're a new viewer, make sure to hit that subscribe button, and if you enjoy my doll reviews on Never After High, hit the thumbs up. And here's a look at the back of her box and about her dragon whose name is Brush Fire. And dragon magic is fire breathing, scale color, lavender locks, favorite food, hot peppers, flying trick is cloud comer, and special defense, heat armor. It sounds pretty cool. Some of the other Dragon Games dolls are Raven Queen, Darling Charming, and Holly O'Hare, Poppy's sister. And the lovely artwork of Brush Fire with Poppy. So cute. Poppy comes with her very own dragon book. And on the one side it has pictures of the dragon arena. And on the other side it has rules of dragon games. And then a note from Poppy about her dragon. She also comes with the silver Ever After High stand and comb. Along with a ring you can wear that has a P for Poppy. And it looks like a shield. And here's a look at Brush Fire, her dragon. It, she's purple with pink horns and wings. And her tail is a, uh, a braided uh, tail. It looks like hair braid. She has green eyes. Very small and baby-like, like it just hatched from the egg. Here's an up-close look at her makeup. She has smoky purple and pink eye makeup with a bright pink lipstick. She has this braided silver headband. It has some chains on the sides and then a flower on the forehead. She has her short hairstyle with the purple in the front and it's very gelled and stiff to keep it in place. Here's a look at her outfit starting with the two shoulder uh, armor pads. They're made out of silver with some braiding detail along the edges. She has a silver necklace and then a black, purple, and silver outfit. A uh, silver belt that has a pair of scissors and also a gauntlet and silver chainmail that also has a pair of scissors. And then her top is this uh, shiny black material that goes into some silver and purple leggings. And then she also has these tall boots that look like they have a dragon scale pattern on them and black laces up the front. And that's how the heel looks. She also has this longer piece coming out of the back of her shirt towards the bottom that is braids of hair and it's purple with black print. And here is how Poppy looks holding her little dragon bush, brush fire. So cute. I love her outfit. I do think it looks like she raided Raven's closet though because for uh, Poppy, she usually has a lot more pink in her outfit, and this one is pretty much just purple, silver, and black, which really reminds me of Raven, but it looks gorgeous on her anyway. And here's Holly and Poppy side by side, so you can see how amazing they look in the Dragon Games. I love these outfits for them. They're so pretty together. And here's three different poppies to compare side by side in a short doll comparison. I know these aren't all the poppies out there, but these are the three I had. So I wanted to show them side by side so you could see them together and get an idea on how they look. 
Obviously, with Dragon Games and the signature Poppy, she has her short hairstyle. But with the Fairest on Ice, they gave her long hair. Here's an up-close look at each of their makeups. Fairest on Ice is a frosty kind of look with the uh, pearly pink lips in light pink eyeshadow. And then some snowflakes under her eye. Dragon Games, as you saw, was a smokier purple eyeshadow with bright pink lipstick. And then finally, the original signature Poppy has different shades of purple and pink lipstick and eyeshadow. Here's a quick look at the Fairest on Ice's outfit. She has the little scissors, which all three of them have at least one accessory that has scissors on it. And you can tell this has a lot more pink than either of her other outfits, and it's a lot lighter pink, but there's purple and white and silver mixed in with it. And then with the signature Poppy, I, for one, love her ear cuff that has the little pair of scissors, and then she has her scarf in that silver, and then the outfit underneath with the braiding detail, the scissors on her dress, as well as her ring, and lots of braids and her bag with all her hair styling uh, tools. I thought that was really cool. And then the hot pink shoes. So which one out of these three is your favorite Poppy? I think my favorite is still going to be the original one. I just um, think her style was perfect and I liked her ear cuff the best and the makeup. But let me know down in the comments which is your favorite. And thank you so much for watching this Poppy O'Hair Dragon Games review and quick doll comparison. Uh, if you enjoyed it, like I said, make sure to give this a thumbs up. And make sure if you're not subscribed already to hit the subscribe button. I'll see you guys later. Bye!